Hi guys, welcome back. This is L. Isa doing a monthly subscription review on BarkBox. Now this was a one month subscription that I had done and it, this is actually new for BarkBox. I don't think that they used to do this before. They used to have only a three, six and a 12 month program. So I'm really excited to get into this with you guys. I saw this um, advertised on my email and I had to take a um, take a shot at going back to them again. Uh, this is a monthly subscription box for puppies, dogs, however you want to call them. Not sure if they do one for cats. You could check their email or not their email, their website. Sorry. All that information will be down below. That's BarkBox.com. One thing I love about this company is that they give 10% of their profits to animal rescues. They often donate these types of boxes with all the goodies to the animals that are in their sh uh, different shelters. So if you're interested, I have all the um, information down below on the various subscription plans. Uh, this one was uh, twenty nine dollars, and uh, normally a one month box costs about that, but the contents of the box are thirty nine um, dollars. So at least you get your money's worth. And I have two dogs. They are medium size. Uh, one is a 30 pound dog and the other one's 55. So it's nice that I got two gifts to be able to get the dogs. Comes with a little card. It talks about how there is an app for the iPhone and Android users. Then it talks about all the different types of products, toys and treats that are in the box and how much they cost. And if you are not already familiar, the BarkShop.com, which is affiliated or it's their um, shopping online store, has really cute deals on toys and treats, different kinds of goodies, along with swag products for doggy owners like tote bags, etc., scarves, things of that nature. Actually, really cute things. So even though I am not a monthly subscriber like I used to be, I still subscribe to their online I guess catalog for uh, the bark shop. Here's one of the toys. Squeaky toy. Here's another one. I think this one makes a funny sound. Looks sounds like it's farting. See, sounds like a fart, doesn't it? <laughs> and it's arms if they want to pull and play. Very cute. I'm happy because I have one for my girl dog, one for my boy dog. Next that they have, I'll start off with this one. This is a 100% pig ear. It's a good size. I can cut it in half to share with the dogs. I typically don't buy these types of treats for my dogs because they tend to be oily and smelly, but uh, it makes them happy, keeps them occupied for a, a few hours, so why not? Uh, I, as you can see, I've already sampled them to give to them. I didn't want to film with them because uh, they were going to get all nuts when they see me open uh, this box and they would just wait here. So, um, and I wouldn't be able to get through the video. This is the chicken strips made with fruits and vegetables, peas, carrots, apples, bananas, and honey. Uh, these, these jerky strips, basically, or these uh, chicken strips, they're a good size. Look at that. And they have a pretty good weight to them, so they're, they're not flimsy. My dogs love these. So, good job, Bark, uh, bark Box. This one smells amazing, folks. This is pumpkin pie, and it definitely smells like pumpkin pie. And this is Grandma Bowser. I pronounced it wrong the first time. And they're granola cookies for dogs. Wheat, corn, soy free, and it has apples with pumpkin. And my dogs loved these ones, you guys. And it actually smells really good, kind of like you want to eat it yourself. So that's what a cookie looks like or biscuit. Pretty good size. Oh, it smells so good. I wish you guys can smell this. So if I can find these out in the market at one of your local 
pet stores, I would definitely invest. And that's actually how I got into some of my other dog treats that I've been consistently buying for my dogs is because I found them through BarkBox. If you guys have dogs that have like allergies, etc., they now cater to those types of dogs. So definitely take a look at BarkBox.com to get more information. Now, if you are interested in getting a subscription, I and it's your first time, I would definitely recommend maybe going for the one month, no strings attached, $29 per month, that's with this box, or you can try to go for, find a deal on Groupon, which is what I did like many years ago, and basically I only paid like between seven to what felt like $14 per month, let alone maybe even $9 per month, for like three to six months, that was like seriously the best crazy deal. If I could find it, I'd share it with you guys, but I haven't found one since. So definitely um, that's to consider. Again, I'll put all of the cost of the different subscriptions down below. You can obviously go to their website. I'm not paid by them. I purchased this on my own, um, but I definitely like companies like BarkBox because they give back to the community and they give back to other dogs to help save their lives, so why not? Um, Thank you for taking a look at this review. Hope you enjoyed it. Please let me know how you found me. Give me these. Click a like, etc. You know the whole spiel. I um, appreciate your time. Hope you found this video helpful. And um, I'll see you guys for my other unboxings of Julep and Birchbox. And I think in March I'm going to be doing a unboxing for... Barney's Love Yourself event in 2016. All right, guys, you have a good one. I'll see you guys soon. Bye.